Hey guys, welcome back to another video with Straight Outta Content brought to you by Flash Custom Transfers. And today I'm gonna show you guys what exactly a DTF is. So if this is your first time tuning in, we make direct to film transfers, okay? So what that is, that is a transfer, a full color transfer kind of seen in this video. Oh, I'm gonna kind of play this video. I'm gonna turn down the audio a little bit. Um, it's a full color transfer. As you can see in this video, let's go ahead and turn on the audio. It's a full color transfer and it's printed on this film. On this big, big, big piece of film here, as you can see in this video. So what I'm gonna do is guys, I'm gonna start the video, I'm gonna rewind it back, I'm gonna kinda of walk you guys through the whole process of DTF, what exactly the machine is, what this big uh, aluminum like metal exhaust thing is, what everything is in the world of DTF, true commercial grade DTF. So let's go ahead and get started because um, I wanna make this video really precise and not like full of bloat. So <clears throat> just so you guys know, what you see on YouTube, if you just go to YouTube and you type in DTF, you're gonna see a lot of people out here who claim to be printing DTF. So they have machines like this, or machine like this. I think that might even be a press. Um, I quit using vinyl. This right here is is close. And you say I lost $2,400 in a day. This machine is close to the one that we have, but it's not, it's not the full machine. And in fact, the one in the video, this is actually an old machine. This is a two head printer. We now have four head printers in our new warehouse, but uh, we don't film that anymore. Um, do just, just due to uh, competition and stuff like that. And then we also, so yeah, as you guys can see, this machine that he has, these are more of the commercial grade printers that we print with. Um, but as you can see with this whole bucket, I'm not gonna play the video for YouTube purposes, but as you can see this process right here um, and what you're looking at on the screen to the left is an at-home DTF printer. And to the right, I think that's the oven that bakes it. These are not the types of printers that we print from. Now this company right here, we use oddly, but this right here is very close to the type of printer that we print from. I think this one is a uh, 18 inch, uh, cause ours is a uh, 22 across and I'll show you guys. Uh, well, really ours is a 24 inch printer, but I'm gonna go ahead and scroll through and you see this, try to get close. You see this line right here, this line right here keeps the ink in, oh, we'll kind of bring it back a little bit. It keeps the ink kind of wet in the in the print head. So this print head it runs a continuous bead every time it goes across. So I'm gonna explain exactly what it's doing every time it goes across. But I just want you guys to get really familiar with what this process is versus any other process on the market, including other DTF processes that, um, that aren't on a commercial grade. And like I said, this technology, this is a two head printer. Uh, but all the printers that we have now are forehead, which print twice as fast. Um, and again, we're on 22 by 24 inch sheets because this is really 24 inches across, but this piece right here is trimmed off. So a lot of your transfers that you get, this is trimmed off at our factory and you guys just get the nice clean, the clean transfer. I just want to go back over here to YouTube just one more time, just to show you that this right here is kind of like the beginning stages of commercial grade DTF. When you get to something like this, where it just shows watch before buying DTF printer and regrets two months ago. Yeah, I would, I would do the same thing too. If this was my DTF printer, because this and this, these print entirely two different products. Like this is like the easy bake oven. And then this is, you know, a $10,000 oven even though it's only probably 18 inches across maybe. And then you cut off, so you're down to like 16, you know what I mean? And then compared to what we have now, but Cold Desi, they do make really good uh, DTF printers. They do, we don't have them, but they do make them. Is this uh, how long, you see this as well. This again is not the same um, type of printer that we have. So to just explain to you guys what DTF is, so that you guys can see DTF, and I'll just go ahead and play the video. DTF is, direct to film. So what's going on here, and I'll reverse back is, let me get back to, oh, that's Shelly. What's going on here? We'll kind of get, let's get some right here. Let's get really close. 
What's going on here is each time the print head passes, it's laying down color and adhesive all at the same time. So this white that you see, this is the adhesive, the color all at the same time. So as you'll see here, the, uh, let me get closer, let me get a little closer, bring it back a little bit. So, okay, right there, as you can see. So back here, it's printing the color because all, all back here is just blank, blank film. So it's coming through the rollers and the back of this is printing the color and then the front of it is printing the white. So as you can see here, you're gonna see the image start to kind of turn white because that's the adhesive going on the back. So as you can see, you can see the color and we're going here to the auger and I'll, and I'll explain this process after, but I really wanna focus on this process right here, right there. You can see it. You can see the color and then it's starting to get white and that's because this is laying down the color and the adhesive all at the same time and then kind of cleaning itself over here. We can go back over here and we can see that as well. I get pretty good length video of it. And I'll talk about the exhaust, but this is, again, I want to really specify the difference. They don't do this as super color. Um, and the smaller machines, these smaller machines do do it, but it's all done inside and it's not done at the like especially like this machine, it's not done at the precision and at the quality of a machine like this. And again, we uh, and again, these are actually old machines. So the machines that we have now are even faster, better, more precise. And what's happening is a lot of people are getting even these machines, both of these machines, this machine and this machine require a lot of maintenance regardless of which one you have they require a lot of maintenance the difference is that this one is all built in one but it's meant for a warehouse or some type of outdoor or garage maybe type of operation these you can do in your house because you are able to uh, come over here and you are able to have a bucket and pour your your powder on it which is your adhesion so let's go back over here to to watch how this prints. And as you can see with each pass, it's putting down color and the adhesion and it's extremely precise. Look at that, extremely precise. Colors, everything, look, see how it's starting to, see, let's rewind that a little bit. Look how it's all black and then all of a sudden you're gonna start to see it turn white. That's because it's already laid down its color and we can do any color, DTF can do any color and it can do it extremely vibrant. And then now as you see, it's turning white and as you see, it, go, it goes down and again, this process right here is extremely dangerous. And that's the reason why there's a big exhaust system built into it. Because doing this at home, baking this at home, and as you see right here, you'll see it come on, you'll see the big red light come on and give it a couple seconds. That Once that red light comes on, it's extremely hot in that oven. So it's gonna come down and all at once, the auger is gonna shake the adhesive powder on the back of the white all at the same time while baking it. That is something that you do not want to do at home. There is a, here's a better video of it. This is something that you do not want to do at home. It's extremely dangerous. And as you can see, this exhaust, where's it? I got another video of the exhaust. All of our ovens are properly, have proper um, exhaustion, have proper ventilation. All of our printers um, have proper ventilation and this is what's required. So anytime I see a video of like, and I'll type it in DTF hack, hack with sublimation. I'm seeing a lot of these videos come up and these, everybody's using, um, oh, shout out to her. Everybody, it's very dangerous because you're taking the powder that's, see, whenever you're pouring the powder on that and then you're baking it, once you do that, you're not supposed to be around those fumes. Those fumes are supposed to be, you know, brought out of the building, brought out of the area. And unfortunately, that's not what's happening. And it's a very, very, very dangerous process to even him, even he has an exhaust. Um, who else? Oh, oh, this is coming soon. That's definitely coming soon, UV DTF. And as you can see here, what type of, as you can see right here, he has an exhaust too coming out as well. You do not wanna touch the powder, let alone on a regular basis. You don't wanna touch the powder on a regular basis and you don't wanna breathe in these fumes. So as, you, as we're gonna come back over here to the main video, you can see right here, this is wrapped up very, very, very tight. And even with this, whenever you walk into the warehouse, you can still kind of smell everything because of these ventilations and stuff like that, because the heat still has to be, um, so has to leave the oven. So again, this is what DTF is. And once it, so it's printed and it, and the adhesion is put on it at the exact same time. And we'll just go through the whole video. 
So this is the big exhaust, right? So it's printed on the film. We use, it's really 24 by whatever, you know, the length of the roll is, but we cut it at 24. We cut it at 22 by 24. That's how we sell our sheets. It's printed, the beautiful image is printed. It then comes down here to the auger and is automatically, the powder is put on it. It's then baked, as you guys can see right here, as I zoom in, it's then baked to its proper temperature and cured properly. And just to kind of stop this video for a second, whenever I say cured, you hear this process in screen printing, if you're familiar with screen printing. And with screen printing process, you get a lot of, well, it wasn't cured, that's why it cracked. In fact, I'm wearing an old screen printed shirt right now and it's extremely cracked. Well. There, the process to cure that is really, it's not automated. They do have some automatic machines that can, that can squeegee it on, but I'm not sure about the, um, about the curing process, but with DTF, it's automatically cured properly right here. So when it comes to certain colors like blacks, it has to actually bake at a longer temperature because black, for some reason, the ink takes a little higher heat, but outside of that, it's going to bake proper every single time. This way you're getting more of a uh, of a streamlined product and you're not having a you're not having too much human error involved in each individual image especially whenever you're printing thousands of images a day like we are tens of thousands of images tens of thousands of transfers each day so again we're back here whenever you see a gap that's between one project to another and again you can see right here you can see the the line where it's cleaning, where the print head is cleaning, and then you see the exhaust, and then this is where it comes out here down at the bottom. And here we're gonna cut again to an up close shot of what is going on with our DTF printers. These are our, these are our old ones. I think we still have a few at the shop just in case, um, cause you never wanna, um, you never wanna get rid of everything just in case you ever have to print some small jobs or one of your big uh, forehead printers go down, you still wanna be able to print. So, and as you can see, we can print very small, very big, extremely detailed. And we're gonna pan over here to the oven again and watch it bake, watch the auger shake. Again, you're not hand doing this. There's nobody standing over it, shaking it. It's all done by machine like it's supposed to be. Okay, guys? So this is what your, whenever you get a transfer, this is the, these are the printers, or these were the printers now that we upgraded, but these are the printers of the, um, that your transfers are being printed from. A full commercial grade, high quality, full color HD transfer. <laughs> I know it's funny, I know it's a lot of words, but I just really wanna emphasize that, that because this is not what, and a lot of people are turned off, unfortunately, by DTF because, and I'll go ahead and stop it, because, You've got people on Facebook and stuff like that with these types of DTF printers and they're selling it by the sheet, by these little, you know, 12 inch sheets like that. And look, she's pouring it on there and, and then baking it and then you're getting their product and you're wondering why it's cracking or you're wondering why, you know, it's not doing what it's supposed to do or you're spending the time and you're just buying one of these machines because you've seen somebody on YouTube do it and you're spending, you know, 5,000, 3,000, 6,000. Oh, that's our retail product that's coming soon. I am on here. <laughs> that's our retail product that's coming soon. But you know what I mean? And we can do this too, by the way. We can, this is easy. We do this all the time. But as you can see, his, uh, here, see, this is a real DTF machine. This is a real DTF machine. As you can see the exhaust and stuff like that. And again, we always promote purchasing DTF in your local area is gonna save you money because one, you're helping your local small businesses. And two, you don't have to worry about shipping. You're able to just go and pick up your print. It's just uh, handling these machines is extremely difficult. There's a lot of money. That's the reason why you got a video, a guy like this, I lost $2,400 in a day because something probably uh, go Go do DTF, they said, it'll be fun. Yeah, it's, it, oh no, 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 don't play that, don't play that. <laughs> I thought I was gonna play. But, um, you know, these things can happen and when something goes down, you're the one who has to pay for it. You know, printers go down for us all the time, all the time, it's not, it's, it's not easy. It is not easy to run these printers all day, game changer, even this printer right here. And then uh, let me see what type of printer this is from the looks of it. It doesn't look like a, a commercial grade. Anyway, just to kind of finish out this video, hopefully you guys, hopefully I was able to explain exactly. And you guys look, all the machine, as you guys can see, hopefully you guys are able to see 
exactly what a real DTF direct to film transfer is and the quality and the product that we print. Again, this is some old footage because we will no longer be showing our warehouse just due to competition and stuff like that. And there's a lot of other things going on behind the scenes. So we do not, these are all old videos of our old printers. But again, as you guys seen uh, Miss Shelly there, she's there, we were there, you know, at our old warehouse showing you guys. And I just thought for 2023, a lot of people don't know what DTF is. They're coming to the website and they, they just don't know what DTF is. So I felt that it was my duty to show all the new people out there and all the current people who purchased from us just exactly what DTF is. It is a direct to film transfer, full color transfer printed on a specific film with a very specific adhesive that allows it to stretch, never crack, uh, won't peel as long as it's pressed correctly and you're able to get full color images for your apparel that can go on basically anything. Anything apparel, clothes, material wise, it can be pressed on that at a certain temperature. And if you have any questions, please email us at order now at flashcustomtransfers.com. Again, you can email us at order now at flashcustomtransfers.com. Please email us. If you don't know anything about DTF, email us email us email us before you purchase and if you do know about dtf and you're ready to purchase and you're ready to get high grade real dtf you can get it at flashcustomtransfers.com Hey, baby. Look how beautiful that is. Just pure beauty. The best product on the market. No screen printing here. Doesn't take a lot of people just takes a lot of knowledge. Look at that. Look at the precision. The strongest transfer in the world. All types of colors, realistic images. DTF is definitely the future of full color transfers. You don't have to touch it. Again, it's a very extremely difficult process to run these machines day in and day out. Things do go wrong, but if you have a strong team like we do, you make it look easy. Remember guys, if you have any questions, order now at flashcustomtransfers.com and you can purchase at flashcustomtransfers.com. If you are not a member, please sign up for our Flash Plus program for $8.99 a month and you will get discounted prices on our transfer sheets and shipping. And if you have any questions or you want to order through email, say you want a big order, go ahead and email us at order now at flashcustomtransfers.com and we can handle any big order or small order at that. Thank you guys.